Hello everyone. Good evening everyone. Can I have some quick comments if you can hear my voice? Hello. Good evening everyone. Are you able to hear my voice or not? Hello? Hello everyone. Yes, so hello everyone and this is Vaishali Kamdar from Spark Academy and today we will be discussing weightage part biology topics and weightage for MSET as well as NEET. So stay tuned with me on next, I mean, we will be discussing first MSET, then NEET, we will be discussing what is, what is the chapter-wise weightage for MSET as well as NEET. So do not go anywhere. Hi, this is Vaishali from uh, Spark Academy. And as you know, BP Sapka high ho gaya honga now fluctuate kar raha honga because exams are coming. I mean, the dates are too close now. So you should be... Yes, so you should be uh, prepared for these things. So now you should know you should do smart work rather than uh, just, uh, I mean, just struggling and uh, hard work. So hard work is important. But right now at the last moment, you can uh, do smart work also by using the weightage uh, this video. So you can know the better about the weightage of the chapter. So those who are, I mean, those who have who are preparing for the last minute, they can uh, choose uh, chapters which are having higher weightage for the exam point of view. So now we'll be discussing that. So before that, let me tell you that this is Park Academy, and you can join classroom as well as online coaching, short term. Crash course and regular course is going on and right now uh, we can say um, early long term batch has been also started. So daily live classes, daily uh, doubt clarification sessions, PYQs, tips and tricks we are discussing. For that you can download the app Spark Academy app and you can get updates for that. So these, uh, this, is, uh, this is me that is Vaishali. And today we'll be discussing this topics and weightage, uh, topic-wise weightage for MSET. So biology, you know, botany and zoology, uh, it is divided into two. So 40, 40 questions from each, 40 questions from botany, 40 questions from zoology. So 20 from first year syllabus, 20 from second year syllabus. So mostly for MSET, MCQs are there match the following assertion reason-based question and statement-based question. So, botany, diversity in living world, biological classification, branches of the biology. So, around two to three question you can expect from diversity. And then, five percent from plant kingdom. Morphology, uh, morphology of the flowering plant, again, five percent. Sexual reproduction in plant, it is very, very, very important, guys, for exam point of view. Sexual reproduction in plant, it comes in the second year NCRT, second chapter. So uh, that is a uh, weightage of that chapter, it is 11%. So very important. Then uh, plant systematics, two questions, cell structure and function. Again, important uh, chapter, important unit as you see, important in terms of as you are studying it from the 8th, 9th standard. So it is easy peasy types and still it will give you uh, five questions. Histology and anatomy, 7%. Plant ecology two questions plant physiology again second important second important chapter plant uh, not chapter second important unit okay so five questions you can expect for from uh, mset you can expect to five questions from that genetics genetics in that principles of inheritance molecular basis of inheritance and in biotechnology Biotechnology again two to three questions principles of inheritance and molecular basis of inheritance also genetics three questions so in botany important question if important if I say only weighted higher weighted uh, chapters then sexual reproduction in plants anatomy and histology 
that means morphology and anatomy of flowering plants and genetics two chapters from genetics plant physiology it includes transport mineral nutrition photosynthesis respiration and plant growth regulators and biotechnology two chapters techniques and principles so these are important chapters in botany now zoology so 20 questions from zoology actually 40 marks from the 40 marks for zoology yes so 40 marks for zoology so 20 question from first year syllabus 20 from the second year syllabus so structural organization in animals two questions invertebrate phyla that means uh, animal kingdom two to three questions phylum chordata specially chordates two questions locomotion two questions biology and human welfare three to four questions and type studies of the periplaneta americana periplaneta americana three questions okay then ecology three questions human physiology human physiology five to six question human reproduction three question again applied biology two questions so uh, this is about mset program mset uh, weightage now we'll discuss about the need part So neat botany chapter wise weightage. Neat botany chapter wise weightage. So you can see from this pie diagram, you can see from this pie diagram that which is having more uh, weightage. Genetics and evolution. Genetics and evolution 20%. Then after that, plant physiology 19%. Plant physiology 19%. Then cell structure and function, chota sa unit, easy peasy types and short and sweet 17% and a single chapter, I am not talking about you need a single chapter, that's why it is very important, sexual reproduction in flowering plants. Yes, hello students, I have just now completed sexual reproduction in flowering plants in offline classes and will be doing shortly in online classes. Uh, and sexual reproduction in flowering plants that is uh, having weightage of 7%. Single chapter, this is complete unit guys. Five chapter gives you 19%. Here also three chapters gives you 20%. But this is I am talking about one chapter only. Then structural organization in animals and plants. That means morphology of plants, uh, anatomy of plants, and, and uh, animals tissue and, and animals 10%. Then diversity and living world 10%. Ecology again important 17%. Again it's, uh, it is easy peasy types you can say or uh, storytelling type and still it will give you 17%. So now we will move towards the unit wise discussion. So botany, botany, so class 11 in first year syllabus, yes hello Bhavna, good morning, good evening, sorry. So class 11 plant physiology, in plant physiology, uh, see it includes three or uh, five chapters. Plant physiology includes five chapters, um, transport, nutrition, mineral nutrition, photosynthesis, respiration, and PGRs, plant growth regulators. Okay, so five chapters, number of questions asked from that, it is nine. This is for NEAT, guys. This is NEAT weightage. So, cell, cell and cell cycle. 
again that's why i am telling you cell and cell cycle easy peasy types gives you six question structural organization in plants that means that means morphology five questions diversity of life five questions genetics seven questions ecology seven questions biology and human welfare two questions only reproduction and sexual reproduction two person two questions so zoology mein human physiology human physiology bahut lamba sa human physiology you need too long then it gives you 12 questions too long and rather important two two questions from each uh, you can expect two two questions from each uh, chapter okay sometimes neat is unexpectable so sometimes last year from one uh, one uh, chapter they have not asked any question so it may be happens once in a while once in a blue moon so bio molecules bio molecules give you gives you six questions then animal kingdom five questions structural organization of animals that is tissue of animals and discussion of uh, cockroach earthworm and frog in that cockroach is very important animal husbandry and biotechnology human reproduction and reproductive health evolution theories and evidences human health and diseases so here again biotech gives uh, because of biotech number of questions in, increases so chapter wise discussion now diversity in living world first chapter first you need from first year syllabus see actually you can say zero percent weightage of li living world sometimes no questions are asked but most of the time these questions are considered in biological classification so you can segregate sometime questions that why that's why i have given this average number of question it is around one it's easy peasy types and uh, only name of the uh, some some uh, species you need to remember here and sometimes they ask you question like uh, uh, so uh, if you move from higher category to the lower category in a taxonomy then um, similarities increases or dissimilarities increase decreases likewise some questions they might ask you so this is from living living world then biological classification around 3 to 4 questions then plant kingdom 3 questions so now plant physiology second guys so this is not so next plant physiology so in that uh, transport in plants in next actually cell structure and function okay the unit of life and the cell the unit of life you can expect around four questions from it biomolecules his कौन सी ऑर्गेनल का क्या रोल है इन सेल देन बायो मॉलिक्यूल्स टू क्वेश्चन सेल साइकिल एंड सेल डिवीजन टू क्वेश्चन सब के ओके सो दिस इज दिस इज अबाउट दिस इज अबाउट सेल स्ट्रक्चर एंड फंक्शंस सो देन नेक्स्ट इट इज प्लांट फिजियोलॉजी ट्रांसपोर्ट इन प्लांट मिनरल न्यूट्रिशन Good evening, Madhav. <clears throat> so transport. So see, in physiology, whether it is human physiology, whether it is plant physiology, you can expect one to two questions from each chapter. Okay, that's why totally around ten to twelve questions. so transport 1 to 2 mineral nutrition around 1 to 2 yes mahadev other subjects i am talking about biology right now you will be getting other subjects weightage weightage of other subjects shortly will be uh, i mean doing other another live class uh, for physics chemistry as well as maths 
okay so that is that will be discussed later on right now we are discussing about biology okay mahade so complete botany as well as zoology complete botany as well as zoology uh, weightage chapter wise weightage discussion so first diversity of living world discussed then cell structure and function then next it is plant physiology you can see here one to two questions from each subject e uh, sorry each chapter then easy peasy types hai transport mein aur kuch mein discuss karna hai osmosis diffusion uh, active passive and translocation long distance transportation in that you need to think about the transpiration pool and dentition and root pressure for xylem and phloem mass flow and pressure flow mechanism transport then mineral nutrition nutrition yes mother so uh, maths physics and chemistry will come up with the maths physics and chemistry shortly okay so that you will be getting notification what you can do mahadev you can subscribe to our channel so uh, you will be getting notification when we will be discussing about this shortly we'll be discussing about the weightage part of physics chemistry as well as maths for mpsec for npc okay so now structural organization in animals and plants so morphology of plants anatomy of flowering plants so morphology three to four questions mostly mostly asked question from morphology it is on inflorescence inflorescence so special type of inflorescence are also important for exam point of view though these are not given in ncert but you can refer to your state level book for that and these are very important even i have taken one uh, one uh, live class one youtube class for inflorescence so you can check that special class on inflorescence in this uh, channel okay you have subscribed i i hope you have subscribed to spark academy channel and then you can go and search in biology section and that you can go and search for inflorescence i have taken already i have taken one youtube class on inflorescence So in that I have discussed all the type of inflorescence in detail. So that will help you a lot. So morphology and flowering uh, of flowering plants, three to four questions. Anatomy again, three questions. So you can see here, plant kingdom, three questions. Animal kingdom, three to four questions. In in animal kingdom, we are discussing all the phyla. all the phyla start from porifera porifera then echinodermids then uh, platyhelminthes eschelminthes uh, tinophora everything so every phyla it is important for exam point of view three to four questions from single chapter so this is why it's very important then human physiology see i have told you that from plant and from from human physiology you can expect one to two questions from each each uh, chapter so here also digestion and absorption two question breathing exchange two questions circulation two questions excretion again two question locomotion one to two neural control and coordination two and again hormones ka part and all the glands important three questions so you should not skip this chapter in human physiology this is important in human physiology okay yes padmavati i have discussed already in first 10 minutes i have discussed that but still i'll be discussing if we uh, get to time okay so i'm discussing again so i'll discuss it again so then ecology and environment so organisms and population wait yeah so ecology and environment 
so organisms and populations so two questions from ecology again four chapters in ecology so two two question two two three questions from each chapter biodiversity conservation organism and population may say mainly from that chapter you can get you can get a numerical type question numericals growth rate birth rate types question okay biodiversity environmental issue all this uh, chapters around 3 3 3 2 to 3 questions pollution ka part you are discussing here then genetics and evolution genetics and evolution principles of inheritance and variation in genetics this is mendelian genetics very 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 important look at the weightage neat weightage for five to six questions genetic disorder or you can say mendelian disorder chromosomal disorder as well as monohybrid cross dihybrid cross test cross everything very important chapter for exam point of view even molecular basis of inheritance four questions so i'll give one star to that also okay evolution three questions then reproduction in organism reproduction in organism one to two questions easy peasy again sexual reproduction in flowering plants in that we are discussing pre-fertilization event then fertilization post fertilization event or structural change so all these things can be discussed here in this answer wall and uh, microsporangium and megasporangium it is important point so three to four questions from one single chapter and then human reproduction three to four questions he reproductive health two questions again this is a storytelling type chapter so yes padmavati i hope you are there so now again i'll be repeating uh, weightage weightage for need and on the whole in one sing single pdf you can see here and then I'll be discussing MSET weightage again. You can check here botany, uh, chapter name, chapter wise. So again, I'll give you idea about which you should not forget to learn. Okay, one is plant physiology. Plant physiology. then genetics then ecology biotech ye to ma'am ne sara hi kuch bol diya nahi aisa nahi hai you can see this biology in human welfare it is not there so i have selected these okay these four units here and plant physiology also so at least this four chapter four units you should do in botany then zoology and zoology human physiology yeah the biomolecule self you can do bio biomolecule gives you six questions okay then biotech 10 questions and evolutionary theories four questions evolution comes in both the things that's why we have we are discussing in both again i'm repeating chapter wise you can see here noted noting uh, note down each chapter wise weightage so i am giving star here on the basis of their importance Two stars, more than two questions. Okay, more than two questions. Wale ko two stars denge. So noted, note, noted down. Control and coordination. Do not forget to do it. Then in botany, 
morphology, anatomy, two two stars, cell, biomolecule also. Biomolecule तो इतना important है कि chemistry में भी आता है and same thing we are discussing here but uh, from biological point of view, right? Then this is short and sweet and still gives you two questions so that's why I'll give one star. Okay, then human health and diseases to start. Both the biotechnology chapters. Not forget, do not forget to do this. See, sometimes it is two to three questions only, but it is very important. Then environmental issue from ecology. And Mendelian genetics, I'll give three star to it. Molecular basis, two star. Evolution, also. Sexual reproduction, three stars. Single chapter. Human reproduction, two stars. Okay, I hope it is clear for NEET. Any doubt in NEET? Anyone? Those who have joined? NEET chapter wise weightage, any doubt? Yes, Padmavati, now it's for you. you. I hope you are there or you'll be looking this, I mean, you will be watching this video afterwards. So, this is for you, Padmavati. I'm set. I am again uh, discussing I'm set weightage. See here, it is. You know that biology it is divided into botany and zoology. So, 40 questions you will get from botany and 40 questions from zoology. Okay. And from botany, 20 questions from first year syllabus. Yes, Aditya? No doubt? Okay. So, first year syllabus, syllabus 20 questions. Second year syllabus 20 questions. Same in case of zoology also. Question ke types kaun se hai? MCQ. MCQ type normal MCQ option wise. Then match the following. Usme bhi MCQ hi milenge. Then assertion reason based. And statement types. Botany, in botany, diversity in living world includes biological classification, branches of biology, plant kingdom, two to three questions, morphology of flowering plant, 5% you can uh, uh, expect. So that means two to three questions. Sexual reproduction in flowering plant, Deklo star, star Deklo. Yes, Anju. Okay, yes, Padmavati, you can check the stars. So, uh, sexual reproduction in flowering plants, two stars. Plant systematics. That means classification only. MSET ke liye alag hai, Talgu Academy ki book use karenge, that's why. Plant systematics, two questions. Then cell structure and function, five questions. Five questions. So, that's why very important. Histology and anatomy of plant, seven percent question you can expect. Plant ecology, two questions. Plant physiology, especially respiration in plants, it is very important. Genetics, my two chapters, three questions from each chapter you can expect. Then biotech, two to three questions. So important, you note down these chapters. Note down these chapters, guys. Sexual reproduction in plants. Anatomy and histology, genetics, plant physiology, and biotechnology. These are important chapters for both the exam, both of the exams. Okay, NEET as well as MSET. Then zoology pe jate hai. So structural organization in animals. Two questions. Invertebrate phyla. Invertebrate phyla. That means still codex. Still codex. Remember, Spark Academy wale students, yes, you have already made two tables to remember these phylums. Right, these phylums. 
See, I have guided you how to prepare two tables and these two tables, I know it is there over your writing table, so it will help you a lot. You don't need to remember again, rem memorize these things about these two and three uh, section of invertebrate phyla and phylum coordinates. That's why I have asked you to make two tables. Right? Am I right, Anjum? Yes, it, it's, it is there na, over your writing table. Hopefully, sabhi logo ne uh, stick kar diya hoga these two tables. So it will help you a lot. Then locomotion, two questions. Again, two stars wala dekh lo. Biology and human welfare, three to four questions. 15 percent. Then type study of periplaneta americana, three questions. Then ecology, three questions. Human physiology, five to six questions. Human reproduction, three questions. Applied biology, two questions. Human physiology, may five to six questions. Includes five different, oh, sorry, six chapters. Right? So you can expect one, one question from each. From digestion, from respiration, from circulation, from uh, nervous system, excretory system. Then locomotion and chemical coordination. Mostly two questions from chemical coordination. Okay. So this is about MSET weighted. Any doubt anyone? Anyone wants to repeat it? Yes, chalo, chalo, jaldi, jaldi, chat box me dalo if you don't have any doubt. So, I hope we have discussed all the topics now, all the chapter wise discussion. You know what should be what you should prepare. So, start preparing now. You start doing, start doing smart work now. Start doing smart work, okay? Smart work is ko bolte, start doing that now. Divide your time first, revise all these things. Okay, just ki, jo kam weightage wala part hai. See, if you have done completely whole syllabus, then low weightage part you are doing right now and the higher weightage part you will be doing uh, somewhere, I mean, after one, after a few days before your exam. So, you should remember it very precisely. You're getting this point. But those who have not done anything, not prepared anything, complete syllabus is not done, then you go for this higher weighted chapters only. Jisko star diya tha humne. So go for those chapters. So thoroughly do these chapters and I'm sure you will get good marks. Good score. Okay. So for more updates and uh, for uh, our courses, download the app from the, for the great discount on our courses. And you know that after joining this park, you can get free handwritten notes and free study materials and PYQs, free mock tests available. So link is given in the description box. You can purchase any of these things from the description box, long term course, crash course, mock test. Mock tests are also available there. Right now it's time to do just maybe pura syllabus kar liya hai, guys. So it's time to clear, or oh, I mean, it's time to write all the mock tests so you will know where you are standing, what you should do daily. Just try to practice daily one test, previous year solutions, full length test, and study material. Everything is available in Spark Store. Link is there in the description box. So this is what right now going on. Uh, classroom coaching, short term, regular crash course is also going on. Okay, online also. 
everything is going on right now if anyone wants to join any of these courses we are uh, we have started long term admissions early long term admission so you can go and uh, you can apply this coupon code for discount v a i 10 that is vaishali 10 okay so you will be enlisted in my student list and uh, you will be getting a uh, huge discount over the uh, any of the courses so daily on the uh, live uh, session we are taking live session on demand on daily basis so this is what uh, we are doing daily basis that we are giving assignments we are checking that whether it is uh, submitted or at pending test we can test daily chapter wise test is done this is our methodology as you all will be knowing all these things right all this method yes spark students you know that we have highly experienced faculty but those who are not knowing you can check these thing we are see what we are doing basic concepts we are explaining first then shortcut methods we are giving all model questions exercise pyqs test grand test we can test test analysis has been done so why only spark because we have highly experienced faculty personalized coaching we are offering process oriented coaching and personal mentoring and the doubt clarification sessions are also there we have a limited batch size see for regular coaching for or you can say for long term only 20 to 25 students per batch and for crash course it is somewhat around 35 so this is hybrid coaching you can select hybrid coaching also when you are not feeling well or when you are out of station also you can join online classes if you opt for hybrid coaching but if you opt for only online you can't come to the classroom so you will be not having access to the classroom but hybrid coaching may you will be having access to online one also so you can join us on the telegram link also so this is a telegram link so join now for more updates subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for notification do not forget to like and share the video guys bahut bahut zyada zarurat hai like ke so thumbs up thumbs up karna mat bhulna so just touch that thumbs thumbs up icon so and subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for the more no, for more notification yes so maybe we will be discussing a uh, shortly weightage of all other subjects also so you for that you need to subscribe to channel and press the bell icon for the notification these are this is our chemistry faculty maths faculty physics faculty and this is me vaishali chemistry again and uh, owner and maths sir uh, vyas sir physics ma'am these are our results for 2021 and we are expecting uh, much more this time okay last last time it was i mean it was covid time so now we are expecting more uh, this time so this is uh, highest score you can say highest score of 2021 608 608 but we are expecting this time much more higher much higher score this time because we have a we have a very good we have very good students right now with us thank you so much and do not forget to like share and subscribe and do not forget to comment below thank you so much everyone thank you